On a weekly basis, my planning partner and I, we generally do an exit ticket every day um, at the end of a lesson, especially when we're pushing out new content. On a weekly basis, my planning partner and I will decide on one exit ticket to really dive deep, more deeply into and use that data to, that lesson is usually sort of the um, like do not pass go moment in for that week's learning objectives. And so we will sit down, look at that data and then decide like, based on what we're seeing, what do we need to do next week to set our students up for success? So a lot of times that could look like remediating or reteaching in a do first before introducing a new concept. Um, it could look like putting on the homework. So it just sort of takes a variety of different forms of how we um, proceed based on the data. Go ahead and turn to the exit ticket. It's two-sided, your voice is all the way off, your brain is all the way on, and you only have five minutes go. So for exit slips, that feedback is like super fast. I usually grade the exit slips the same day and I give them back the following day. Based on that exit slip data, I'm able to pull small groups. And I'm saying, okay, 75% of the class got this, you guys didn't. This portion, so like four of these students didn't get it because of this piece, four didn't get it because of this piece, and I'll have two small groups during that time to address those things. Um, I'll just pull them for you know maybe eight minutes, address the concern, have them work it out, solve the problem again, and then set them on their way when they've mastered it.